Hello class, the purpose of this video is someone brought to my attention a mistake in one of the videos. And the video was the labeled in green here, the electrophilic aromatic substitution reactions part one video. And the mistake occurred at minute 48.6 or 48 minutes, around 48 minutes, okay? And so I need to correct that error. And it has to do with the mechanism. So what was being covered at 48 minutes is the Friedel Crafts alkylation, where we have this primary chlor uh, alkyl chloride reacting with uh, aluminum trichloride to generate this intermediate. And, and at this intermediate, that's when this carbon right here is electrophilic enough for the benzene ring to react with it. That was all correct in the video. It's once we get down here where things got messed up. So what happened, if we follow the mechanism arrow here, it's saying that the benzene ring, pi electrons, attacked that carbon. And so that would put a a chlorine atom, or sorry, the ethyl group right there. And that is correct. And then in my previous video, I said there was a positive charge there, which there is, and then I drew the hydrogen as well, something like that. And the what I did in the previous video was incorrect because I took this and come took that hydrogen and brought those electrons back to restore aromaticity. And I said, voila, we have our product. Darn it. And I said, there's our product. Well, let's evaluate my mechanism real quick to show why that's a horrible mistake. Let's start looking at it right here. Okay, when I look at that circle carbon, how many hydrogens are out there? There's one right there. And so did that hydrogen move when it went from this part down to here? No, that, hi that hydrogen is still there. <clears throat> so if you follow the red arrows and I rip off this hydrogen here, what does my product actually look like? Well, I still have that green hydrogen right there. And what did I just form? I just formed a Texas carbon. Shame, shame, shame on me. So what is the real mechanism here? We have to replace these red mechanism arrows and say that the base is going to come and abstract the green proton. And then those electrons are going to come back down to restore aromaticity, which you see right there. And now what do we have? We still have this hydrogen. It is still there. No Texas carbons have been formed. Everything looks great now. So my apologies to everyone who got confused because of that uh, mistake. So that is the correct mechanism. And if you have any questions about that, please let me know.